and we have another vlog. <laughs> so this whole month is gonna be chaotic because I have to prepare for the art fair and put stuff out for the Etsy shop and target all the Christmas shoppers, you know? America loves Christmas. It's actually Halloween right now, but my mind is full of Christmas stuff. Tomorrow is November 1st, so I'm gonna launch my Etsy shop. But the main focus is gonna be the art market, so I'm gonna take you along every aspect of everything I'm gonna I need to do for that. Okay, I gotta be dramatically angry at my fishy that he doesn't wanna go outside. What the heck? Why don't you wanna go outside? It's, it's so dark and gloomy outside. It's okay, you need a little like adventure in your life anyways. Oh my goodness, what am I doing? <laughs> Have you ever cuddled with a fish in bed? I didn't think so. So right now I'm filming a commercial for my fish with legs and I have to do voiceover. So this is how I do voiceovers. I get myself really pumped up, put on my fake smile, and put my voice up like a whole nother octave. Just like that. And be very, very ex 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 exaggerated. <laughs> a super friendly and non-complaining... You <sighs> Do you dream of taking your pet on an outdoor fish? Nope. Ooh, I have to get in the mood for this one. I mean, who can resist these luscious legs? <laughs> oh, what a long day. <laughs> I was in class from literally 8 a.m. to 6.20 p.m. No stop. I had a 15-minute lunch break and that's it. I'm so tired. But I published my Etsy shop and it's it's going so good. Thank you so much. I, I'm, I'm, <laughs> I have like no words. We also can't get up because my back hurts so bad. I can't move. <laughs> I can't. I just got back from mini golf. That was so fun. But now I'm in such a good mood. So I'm gonna pack some orders and write some thank you notes. I got myself 200 sheets of cardstock paper. So I guess I'll use that. What if I printed the fish? Good idea. So I quickly made a pattern, gray grayscale pattern of this. So I'm printing this. So oh my goodness. This is hilarious. Ah, that's so many fish with leggies. So I'm gonna cut this and make this into little cards. So I just wrote all my little thank you notes to put in the little packages. I know, I know these little notes can sound a little cliche and repetitive or something, but like I truly mean it from the bottom of my heart. Just, ah, like, thank you so much. Time to pack all the orders. I've never done this before. I hope I do this right. I kind of feel bad because apparently there were like eco-friendly options for the Miller bags. Those are kind of expensive and they were going to take forever to get here. So, please recycle these guys. Wow, a whole three ounces. All the fishies have been successfully mummified. They're ready to travel! We're here at Hobby Lobby. I need to go get a lot of fabric for my fishies. So I'm gonna take you along today. One more. Yeah, gonna get three yards of each and just two yards for the pink one. Okay. Yeah. This is so much. I can't carry it all. Oh my goodness. I just bought $80 worth of fabric. Better be worth it. Um, and I also just realized I might need to go back to get a giant box of stuffing, but I'll wait until I actually run out of it. 
we are packing orders again. Etsy makes it so easy to just print shipping labels. I just have to like hit print and drop it off to the post office. Like, it's so nice. Hello, it is early in the morning and I am testing out my cards! Okay, let's see. Looks good, looks good. I know this is on plain copy paper so it's bleeding through but it's only a test. Let's cut it! Okay, half of 8 and a 5. 4.25. Mm. Oh, this is cute. Okay, I need to fix this one because it's not aligning right. But this one looks good. Ooh. Well, actually, I might need to size it down a bit. <sighs> Adjusting time. Tonight, we are making cards. So, I'm cutting a bunch of pieces and my printer is doing really good. Yeah, you got this printer. You got 20 more pages to go. last fishy from my store that's so exciting and this one is going to pennsylvania wow you're traveling all over the place fishy i know you guys haven't seen me in the same jacket every single night but i swear ouch look at my little it's supposed to be a manta ray but like it's also a stingray. It looks like a stingray, but it's not really a stingray. So I don't really know. I kind of created like a mix between a manta ray and a stingray and I don't know. It's filled with rice, so it's supposed to be a heat pack. I painted it because I don't have time to sew every single one of them. Oh, look how cute! Ah! Okay, time to test it out and see if it doesn't blow up, you know? warm ah oh, that's so nice and the paint is it's not coming off oh my god look how cute look how ah, look at the little legs oh my goodness wow i'm gonna make an ad for him oh cozy ray cozy ray that has a nice ring to it I had no sense of direction, so I made to-do list, and a to-do list, and a to-do list. I'm so tired that I have no emotions right now. Like, I'm actually very excited right now. But I have no energy to show up. Nothing. It is so cold. It is snowing. Oh my god, it's not even in my trunk. So dumb. There's so many people, but I mean, look how pretty it is. 
Note to self, get myself a nice winter jacket. Oh, look how pretty. I don't care about DJ Grinch or whatever the lady behind me was talking about. But I'm going home. Right back here again. Today is leg day. We are going to sew like 30 legs. Who can like work with their hair down? Like somebody's here. One thing about Ohio that is so dry that I get nose weeds so often and that's why I wear a mask all the time. <laughs> why am I always late? That's like my worst flaw. But I'm going to a concert. How exciting. Man, that was cool! Ah, I miss watching band and like live music. I can't see anything right now. I love the energy and the spirit of the crowd. It was so cool. I'm so glad I went. Got packages. This should be my art fair stuff. So let's see. Nice little bed sheets. Because this is going to be my tablecloth. This is a nice color. Oh, uh, do I need to iron it? Hmm, I don't have an iron. Looks cute, right? Next. There. A humidifier! This is not for the art fair, this is for me. Let's see. <laughs> Here, this is what happened. So this is the wire rack. Huh? Uh. Oh! So this is the... So yeah, this is the um, the wire rack that almost every art fair people have. I was like, I don't want to be generic and buy the same wire rack as them, but it seems convenient. It seems very portable and like customizable. So, oh, I need a. I need a, 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 I need a. I'm trying to... Hmm. 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 How do I make this more stable? Because I want to hang him right here. Like he's standing, you know? Who knows? I'm satisfied with this purchase. It is November 23rd. It's my sister's birthday. How fun. I'm so sad I can't get to eat the cake they made. But I did make three big ones and nine small ones today. They're finished. So that's, that's progress. And I really want s'mores. I got s'mores. Why do I never close them? I never eat s'mores with graham crackers. It's strange. I'm not gonna lie, the most annoying part is stuffing the legs, especially the small ones. And flipping them inside out too. I don't know, the small ones are just... And I... Oh God, I don't know what I'm saying. Because they're so thin and small and I can't put in a bunch at a time because it'll all lump up and be all, you know, lumpy. I think I'm going to invest in a sewing machine! Finally! Because, of course, the ones at school are very nice, but... I tried to go sew today, it's Thanksgiving today by the way, and of course, it's closed, 
so that kind of sucks and it's kind of inconvenient to not have one on hand so I can like do small stitches if something's wrong so upon a lot of research and review videos beautifully like brother and it's perfect because it's black friday so everything's on sale add to cart i just bought a sewing machine so excited oh the things i do just for a picture package is here it's a package from zeb oh my gosh i'm so excited your handwriting is beautiful why is it so heavy anyways this is cute is this like a baby blanket <laughs> okay next <laughs> did you really say it's the dolphin banana bucket hat what is this is this drugs what the f what is this Eggnog wasted? <laughs> Eggnog wasted? I'm scared to open what that is. You know what? That's last. Pop tarts? Just plain old brown sugar pop tarts? Thank you, I guess. Did you really send me your hoodie? <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> it smells like your house. <laughs> oh, and of course. This is beautiful. This is way cropped. Look at the little fishies though. Oh, that's so nice. I thought you were only gonna send me this. And I was like, why don't you just use a mailing bag? Why did you get a whole box? But hold on, let me, let me. Of course, it's too cold outside. Super cropped to your extra large. Honey. Is this like your half-eaten sandwich or something? Oh, what the heck? It's layered. Oh, what the heck is this? It's so small. Ah! It's a pink Santa! And this pink snow globe? Look at him! That is so funny. This is so nice, Zeb. I didn't know you could do this. I didn't know you could be so nice. Anyways. Thank you so much, Zeb. I feel nice and comfy now. My homesick is going away. It's just so good. This is so funny. I was not expecting all of this. I will definitely send you something back. Maybe some Ohio merch, because I know how much you want that. <laughs> yeah, I'm so excited. Hello, it is Saturday the 26th of November and I have exactly a week from the art market and I just realized this but I only have like two more weeks of school left which is bizarre and I'm kind of sad about it but the stress is just more overwhelming that it doesn't really it's not really hitting me right now yeah I have so much to do it's like I don't even know if I can do it all. Like, I have um, less than half of the stuff done for the art market. And of course, all this final stuff for school. And I have two commission works. <sighs> Which I'm so grateful for all of the in depth, the, the, the fact that I can like actually do all this stuff and I have work to do. But it's just a little a lot right now because I want to provide like the best quality that I can do. So today I am going to work on the goods, like the sticker packs, all the tags, cutting them out and making the signs too. Because my um, sewing machine is supposed to come today, I hope, I swear, I please come. <laughs> This whole vlog is gonna be me stressing. I know, I'm sorry, but like, it's a lot to do. Uh, printing a bunch of stuff again. Got my sewing machine and I'm watching football. Okay, I just unpacked all this. It's looking beautifully. Beautiful. And like the knobs. Oh my goodness. Wow. Well, I'm about to wind up my bobbin. So.
so let's see. Oh. Does it stop automatically? I hope. Nice. So I'm watching this video to know how to like thread this thing and it's the most beautiful voiceover ever. Now let's take a look at how to pass the upper thread of your machine. Ensure that the main power switch is off. It is the off. Foot lever is this makes me excited. Raise the needle by turning the hand wheel toward you. The main power switch on. Set the pattern selection dial to straight stitch sewing. Oh, I love this like little groove right there to know when it's up so I can easily just find it. Well, Ohio lost. Maybe it was because I was watching. But look at the manta ray though! Looking cute! And we have more stuff to cut. Lovely. Today, I cut out four sheets of stickers. Now I need to do another batch, but I only have two more sh sticker sheets left. I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Fifteen angular sticker packs. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. I need like ten more of each. That's not gonna happen, actually. At least I have some. <laughs> I was just thinking about how much I've been complaining and stressed over and overwhelmed by everything I have to do, especially the art market. But the more I think about it, I shouldn't be stressed about it and overwhelmed about it because this is what I love to do and I need to be enjoying the process and giving it my all and my best and putting out something that I'm actually proud of because people are going to pay money for this. They're gonna give up their money for this or or they're not even going to if it's not if it's not showing in my work. Screw the what's that called? To do list that I made. I'm gonna accept the fact that I'm gonna work at my own pace, enjoying it and making the best quality things as possible. Because that's what I ultimately want for everybody. I don't want any half assed things to go out on my table. That's not my work. That's not me. Look what my professor just gave me! I made a new boy! Okay, I have legs! Okay. Uh, Learned a lot of yeah. good things. I want to fall in my eyes. <laughs>